Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, we will learn about how to find or how to get the current date and time within the Visual Basic .NET. The compiler or IDE we are using is the Visual Studio. So how we can do that? First you need to click on File, then on New and then on Project. Here you can see a lot of options. So we will select Visual Basic and Windows Forms application. Click OK and it will open the GUI window for us. You just need to take one. What's called is the push button. OK, this is our push button. OK, now we need to double click on it. So it will take us to the callback of our this simple button one underscore click private function. So whenever the button will be clicked, all these statements within this uh, within this function will get executed. So how now we, we need to write dim as a string. So we, we have we declared a variable with the name s and what sort of data it can take, it can store the data which is which belongs to the string data type dim ss string and then we need to write the next thing we need to write is s is equal to okay date time dot now okay so date time dot now will will give us this function will gives us the date and time the current date and time okay but we have to convert them into string data type okay two string okay so two two string okay like this so we need to write like that two string so first it will give us the date and time and then it will like uh, give us two string it means that it will convert date time format into the string format so and then after all this is done the data is given back to the variable as so now we will take one more thing and that is called as the um we can say label we can say label or like a edit box text box anything like uh, so that we can show over time like this okay now now we will go for its properties okay this is text box and we have to go for its fonts and all the things its properties okay name and this name is text box okay foreground color font okay okay so 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 we will go for fonts we will select here like uh, the maximum size is 48 72 okay and here we will go for like uh, stencil okay so there isn't any sort of stencil here so so we will just click on Javanese text okay so click OK now this is our what's called as the okay now we will click on like uh, again we will click on push button we will write here text box one dot sorry text box one dot text is equal to s okay so this is a very simple thing so and it is text box one okay text box one dot text is equal to s so it will show us all the date and time in this box okay like this so can we can we make it a little bit more big yes we can like this and this one more thing that, that we can change their color as well okay so four color can be like um, this green yellow okay and what about big color big color can be black okay now we will run it out we will click on it 
and we will get this thing okay so hopefully you got the concept that how you can make a simple what's called as the simple date and time uh, sure within the visual basic dot net so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe